What's up everyone, if you are new here. Hi, I'm Saoz, an IT specialist and a proud member of the web development team. And today we're exploring IoT hacking tools. These tools are essential for anyone interested in cybersecurity, whether you're a professional or just someone curious about how to protect your devices. Now, before you hit that unsubscribe button, hear me out. I know the word hacking can be intimidating and it often brings to mind images of malicious activities. But in the context of cybersecurity, hacking tools are used for good. I know hacking sounds scary, but trust me, this is important stuff. Understanding these tools can help us defend against potential threats and keep our personal information safe. We're talking about the tools that cybersecurity pros use every day to test and secure the rapidly growing network of Internet of Things devices. These tools help identify vulnerabilities before malicious hackers can exploit them. We're living in a world where everything from your refrigerator to your car is connected to the internet. This connectivity brings a lot of conveniences, like being able to control your home appliances from your phone or getting real-time updates on your car's status. That's super convenient, but it also creates a lot of potential vulnerabilities. Each connected device is a potential entry point for hackers, and without proper security measures, our personal data and privacy could be at risk. That's where these tools come in. They allow us to simulate attacks on our own systems to find and fix weaknesses before someone else does. It's like having a security system for your digital life. By understanding how these tools work, we can better understand the threats to our IoT devices and learn how to protect ourselves. This knowledge is empowering and can help us make informed decisions about the technology we use every day. So, whether you're a tech enthusiast, a security professional, or just someone who wants to keep their smart home from getting hacked, this video is for you. We'll cover the basics of IoT hacking tools, how they work and why they're so important. More than 70% of IoT devices are soft targets for hackers because of a lack of security measures. The data from these devices are helpful for information gathering and analytical purposes. This article explains the various IoT hacking tools and how ethical hackers use them. IoT is a network of internet-connected things or objects that use embedded sensors or software applications to collect and exchange data in real time. IoT includes various devices or objects like home security systems, cameras, refrigerators, etc. that can be connected via the internet. There is a substantial risk of data being stolen or exploited because of the massive volume of data transmitted over the internet. This article highlights some of the popular IoT hacking tools used to detect system vulnerabilities and their use in ethical hacking. But let's understand what ethical hacking is first. IoT hacking tools entail a wide range of activities, including gathering data on payloads, suspicious behavior, etc. IoT hacking tools are software or programs that help in exploiting computer security or networks. These tools can identify security patches in the networks, servers, systems, and applications. We will discuss some examples of IoT tools for hacking later in this article. Ethical hacking safeguards an organization's digital assets from malicious malware cyber attacks. Given that a substantial portion of the workforce is embracing a remote work model, one cannot ignore the relevance of cybersecurity. Cyber attacks are rising with the increasing reliance on cloud-based infrastructure and the development of IoT technology. The crux of a company's security strategy is ethical hacking. IoT tools for hacking aid in the detection of security issues, as well as the prevention of data theft. IoT hacking tools simplify the tasks of all ethical hackers and save their time. Here, we discuss the top five hacking tools. A fiddler is a powerful tracing tool for web traffic that works on any browser or platform. Ethical hackers or security specialists use fiddler to perform web penetration tests. It has many features to enable the phases of penetration testing. This tool also enables security assessments of web applications. It serves as a proxy setting as well as a debugging tool that logs in data transmitted between the device and the internet. With the help of this tool, ethical hackers can monitor web traffic and make modifications before the browser receives the request. Benefits of Fiddler 1. Compatible with every HTTP client 2. Convenient for testing and analyzing websites Maltego is a powerful data mining application. It gathers data and connects it to investigative tasks in real time for open source intelligence and forensics. It is crucial for all security related activities. This comprehensive application enables easy information gathering about domains, DNS, websites, people, search engines, IP addresses, etc. 
This process makes the task of penetration testers or ethical hackers convenient in analyzing relationships between the data. Pen testers can utilize this valuable tool during online investigations and determining the test's footprints. Benefits of Maltego presents information in an easy-to-read format, allows you to extract information from various sources on the web. We have Wireshark. This is the OG of network analysis tools and it's still one of the most powerful. Wireshark has been around for decades and it has stood the test of time. It's trusted by network professionals all over the world for its reliability and depth of features. Think of Wireshark as a microscope for your network traffic. Just like a scientist uses a microscope to see the tiniest details of a specimen, Wireshark lets you zoom in on the minutiae of your network data. It captures packets of data as they travel across your network and lets you analyze them in detail. Each packet is like a tiny piece of a puzzle, and Wireshark helps you put those pieces together to see the bigger picture. This is super useful for understanding how your IoT devices are communicating with the internet. With the rise of smart home gadgets, it's more important than ever to know what these devices are doing on your network. You can see things like what websites they're connecting to, which can be crucial for ensuring your devices aren't accessing malicious sites. What data they're sending and receiving, giving you insights into the kind of information being transmitted. And even what protocols they're using. This can help you understand the technical details of how your devices communicate. This information can help you identify suspicious activity and troubleshoot connection problems. For instance, if you notice unusual traffic patterns, it could be a sign of a security breach. Now, Wireshark does have a bit of a learning curve. It's a powerful tool, but that power comes with complexity. The interface can be overwhelming at first, with so many options and data points to consider. It's not the most user-friendly tool out there, but there are tons of tutorials and resources available online. From video guides to detailed articles, there's a wealth of information to help you get started. And trust me, once you get the hang of it, you'll be amazed at what you can learn about your network. The insights you gain can be invaluable for maintaining a secure and efficient network. It's like having X-ray vision for your IoT devices. You can see through the surface and understand the inner workings of your network, making you a true network detective. Next we have Metasploit the Swiss Army knife of penetration testing. Now, I know what you're thinking. Penetration testing? Isn't that what hackers do? Well, yes and no. Ethical hackers, also known as white hat hackers, use penetration testing to find vulnerabilities in systems before the bad guys can exploit them. And Metasploit is one of their go-to tools. It's a framework that provides a vast library of exploits, payloads, and other tools for testing the security of your systems. Think of it like a digital battering ram. You can use Metasploit to simulate real-world attacks against your IoT devices and see how they hold up. This can help you identify weaknesses in your network configuration, firmware vulnerabilities, and other potential security holes. Now, Metasploit is a powerful tool, and it's important to use it responsibly. You should only use it on systems that you own or have permission to test. Now, let's talk about Shodan. This is where things get really interesting. Shodan is a search engine, but instead of indexing websites, it indexes devices. That's right, Shodan scans the entire internet for devices that are connected to the internet, including IoT devices. This means you can use Shodan to find things like webcams, routers, industrial control systems, and even traffic lights that are exposed to the internet. It's a powerful tool for security researchers, but it's also a bit scary when you think about it. Anyone can use Shodan to find vulnerable devices, and that includes the bad guys. That's why it's so important to make sure your IoT devices are properly secured. Don't just rely on the default passwords and settings. Take the time to change them and make sure your devices are running the latest firmware updates. Moving on to Nmap, another essential tool for network exploration and security auditing. Nmap stands for Network Mapper, and that's exactly what it does. It scans networks to identify what devices are connected, what services they're running, what operating systems they're using, and even what versions of software they're running. This information is crucial for understanding your attack surface and identifying potential vulnerabilities. Nmap is incredibly versatile. You can use it for simple tasks like pinging a device to see if it's online, or you can use it for more advanced tasks like port scanning, OS fingerprinting, and even vulnerability detection. It's a command line tool, so it might seem a bit intimidating at first, but there are tons of tutorials and resources available online. And trust me, 
Once you start using Nmap, you'll wonder how you ever lived without it. Last but not least, we have IoT Inspector, a tool that's specifically designed for analyzing and securing IoT devices. This one's a bit more niche than the others, but it's super useful if you're serious about IoT security. IoT Inspector can scan your network for IoT devices, identify their make and model, and then check for known vulnerabilities. It can also analyze the traffic going to and from your devices to detect suspicious activity. Think of it like a security audit for your smart home. One of the coolest things about IoT Inspector is that it can generate detailed reports that you can use to remediate vulnerabilities and improve your overall security posture. It's a great tool for both individuals and businesses that want to make sure their IoT devices are as secure as possible. So, there you have it. Those are just a few of the top IoT hacking tools that cybersecurity professionals use every day. These tools are essential in identifying vulnerabilities and securing networks. They help in understanding the potential threats that can compromise our devices and data. As you can see, these tools can be incredibly powerful, offering a range of functionalities, from penetration testing to network monitoring. They provide insights that are crucial for maintaining the integrity of our digital environments. But it's important to remember that they can be used for both good and bad. While ethical hackers use these tools to protect and defend, malicious actors can exploit them to cause harm. This duality underscores the importance of ethical practices in cybersecurity. It's up to us to use this knowledge responsibly. By understanding how these tools work, we can better protect our systems and data. Always ensure that your actions are guided by a strong ethical framework. And to make sure that our IoT devices are as secure as possible, regular updates and strong passwords are a must. Don't forget to change default settings and disable unnecessary features to minimize risks. The world of cybersecurity is constantly evolving, with new threats emerging every day. Staying updated with the latest trends and technologies is crucial for anyone involved in this field, so it's important to stay informed about the latest threats and vulnerabilities. Subscribing to cybersecurity news outlets and participating in forums can provide valuable insights and keep you ahead of potential threats. Make sure to check out the resources in the description for more information about these tools and how to protect yourself online. There are numerous guides, tutorials and forums that can help you deepen your understanding and enhance your skills. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Your support helps us create more content like this. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads. We have a lot of exciting content planned and we don't want you to miss out. Stay safe out there and always be vigilant. Remember, cybersecurity is a shared responsibility, and together we can make the digital world a safer place. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Until then, keep learning and stay secure.